And now here I am at the YouTube studio where the zombie apocalypse has happened and I need to save everyone in sight. All right, you zombies, prepare to die. Oh, no way. Welcome back to Teardown. This first map right here has a bunch of different assets from popular maps. So you can probably recognize this bridge right here. And the first thing I'm going to do is demolish it. And detonate. Oh, yes, we've done it. Uh, well, sort of, actually. Maybe it wasn't a good idea to do the pillars there. Anyway, moving on from the bridge, let's see what other stuff we have around the map. We have a plane. Oh, let's see. Can we... Wait, what? Door. Oh, okay. Can we actually drive? Or fly the plane? Eh, I'm in. Oh, yes, drive vehicle. Oh, nice. I don't think we can actually fly it, but, you know, we can drive it around the place. And then again, I do have the thruster mod enabled. So here we go. Full speed. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no. I've just taken down this giant crane right here. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay. Well, that didn't last very long. But this vehicle right here is lined up perfectly with the building over there. So uh, I say we go ahead and ram it into there. And you know what? Let's activate the thrusters. Here we go. And oh, straight into the building. Can we make it through the other side? Keep going. Come on. We got this. Okay. Well, it's not going any further than that. But wait, I have just noticed something. There's another one on top of the building. All right. Here we go. Let's see what happens this time, shall we? Into the train station. Oh, boy. Oh, that's, that's bad. Well, we're here. We have reached our destination. Wow. They're actually <laughs> they're everywhere. All right, let's do it again. So the actual reason that this map was created, I think, is to help with lag. However, because there's so many large buildings... <laughs> what the? I've gone through the floor. It's actually still uh, uh, pretty laggy. So yeah. Right, this says no entry, so I'm going straight through it at slow speed. No. Yeah, no, that didn't really work. But anyway, let's move on to the next map. Now, I'm going to be honest. I'm a little bit nervous about this one because the title of this map is called Ultra Clogged Toilet or something along those lines anyway. Hello? Okay, we have some ragdolls home. Am I supposed to be the plumber? Am I here to help you? Evacuate the building. There's a clogged toilet in here somewhere and I'm going to find it. All right, go. Save yourself. Now, I believe this is the toilet right here. Okay, let's check it out. Hello? Oh, there's someone here. Is he? That's his clothes. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh you're, you're sick. Uh. Oh. Well, that is disgusting. Quick, unclog the toilet. All right, we need more. I've got no choice but to use a rocket launcher. Ow. Not even the rocket launcher was enough. So for that reason, I am sending in a nuke. Here we go. There it is. Oh, <laughs> yes. And you're welcome. Your toilet is now unclogged. Your house might be destroyed, but uh, I've done my job. So this map right here, some of you may have already seen. This is the functional train map. So we're in the train right now. We're going to go ahead and start up just by pulling the lever down. There we go. But I've had an idea and it doesn't involve the train. So let me just go ahead and jump off real quick. It actually involves the horse and carriage right here. So you can actually drive these, which sounds weird because they're horses but yeah look drive vehicle so what i'm gonna do is uh do that jump right there but first i'm gonna set the carriage on fire here we go just gonna set up a light oh yes just to make this stunt even cooler all right here we go come on horses prepare to jump here we go oh we're gonna do it yes oh no one of the horses died and the other one lost all his legs okay all right well uh yeah that's literally why i came on this map for just to do that stunt all right anyway we need to put the fire out problem solved. But while we're here, what kind of fun stuff can we do with the train? I've noticed we have some bridges here, so maybe we should go ahead and set up some explosives. Of course, I have experience in that because of the first map. I went ahead and demolished it. Oh, kind of anyway, but this one should be easier than that bridge. It's a lot smaller, so we shouldn't need as many explosives. Right, I'm going to reduce the explosive size because I don't think we need it too crazy. Okay, now let's just place some around here. Hopefully, we'll have enough to actually demolish the entire bridge. Here it comes. The train is very slow. All right, let's blow it up. Oh, oh no. Uh, uh. Uh, man, I really need to get better at my bridge demolishing skills. But you know what? It doesn't matter because there's another bridge right here. And this time I'm using a nuke. Yep, we definitely cannot fail this time. Three, two, 
one. Oh, there we go. <laughs> kind of defeats the point of it, actually, because we just destroyed the entire thing. The cool part is seeing the train go into the water, and yet we just vaporized it with a nuke. Moving on to the next map. It's actually been a very long time since I've been on the apartments map right here. But I have returned for good reason, because someone has decided to add tanks. Which means we can use these tanks to destroy these buildings. I mean, there is a wrecking ball over there which we could use, but tanks! Tanks are way better, right? And also, look how in-depth this mod is as well. Look at this. We have a little target thing there. Crosshair. Uh, elevate. Wait, what? There's so many buns. Change ammunition. Wait, what? Oh, we can lock the angle and everything. But who cares? Let's just fire. Yes, let's see if we can actually bring down this entire building using only this tank right here. Okay, you know what? I'm going to have to go around a little bit here and fire. Yes. Oh, hang on a minute. We can use the explosive on the back here as well to help us out. Here we go. Yep, that's going to do a lot of damage. Deploy smoke. Oh. That doesn't work. I think some of the controls might be slightly broken on these tanks. All right, here we go. The building is going down. Oh boy, that's a lot of lag. And that is also a giant building that might topple on top of me. I think we might be saved by the other building, actually. Yes, look at that. It's going right through. It's just slicing through the other building. Uh-oh. Oh, no. I think it actually might fall on me here. Unless it's going to hit the other building, in which case we are saved. Yes. Okay. Slicing through that one as well. Save from the other building. All right, here's the challenge. I'm actually... I'm not going to move from this position. Uh-oh. All right, starting now. No moving. Oh, I think we actually might be okay. Look at all the debris as well. Look at that all falling down. The building is still moving. Moving by somehow like balancing on the other building there. This might be a bad idea, but I'm going to shoot at the building. Oh my goodness. That was a larger explosion than I thought it was going to be. Well, let's do it again. Okay. Now the building is really falling on me. Get ready. Oh no. We're going to get crushed by it. Ah, I paused the game. Okay. Uh, yeah. See, the funny thing is, even though an entire building just fell on us, because this is teardown, we're completely fine. But the building is not fine. And now here I am at the YouTube studio where the zombie apocalypse has happened and I need to save everyone in sight. All right, you zombies, prepare to die. Well, die again, I guess. Fire. Let's keep shooting at them. There are so many of them. All right, we need to change the ammo type. Let's go for slug shells. Oh, I need to pump it. Bam! Did I really just miss that zombie? Okay, all right, you know what? We're going around. Let's just keep firing. Oh, maybe I can use this vehicle right here. Okay, let's get in. I'm going to pick up a zombie. Lower the arm. Grab one. I think I have one. Yeah, <laughs> I got him. Whoa, <laughs> look at this. What are you going to do now, eh? You're trying to eat me? Let's reload and let's go ahead and shoot him. All right, buddy. Oh, I shot his leg off. All right, we need to go for the kill, though. Come on. Yes, there we go. These zombies seem to be pretty hard to actually take down. Like, they, they seem to be able to actually take a lot of shots before they die. I guess we really do need to aim for the head here. Let's try explosive ammo, shall we? Fire! Oh, yeah. Hang on a minute. Yeah! Now, this is more like it. Oh, yes. Anyway, let's take a quick trip inside the YouTube studio. I don't think I've actually been inside here before. This is quite nice. Uh, let's see. What, what room is this? Oh, there's a lot of doors. Oh, it's the toilets. We have located the YouTube studio toilets. Okay. What about this door right here? <gasps> we have a green screen. Oh, wow. Hey, look. It's one of my old teardown videos. Amazing. Wow. I hope everyone saw that one as well. What a great video. Anyway, that's enough messing around. We have some more zombies to deal with. Oh, I can see one right there. It looks like they're trying to break into the YouTube studio right now. I see you. All right, let's take them out. There we go. Right, reload the shotgun. I might be able to crawl through here and take them out. There. Got him. Target down. What is this guy doing? He's just crawling. You know what? Let's see if we can pick him up with a crane, shall we? All right, buddy. I see you're having some issues actually standing up. So let me give you a hand. There we go. All right. There you are, buddy. Now, unfortunately, I do have to do this, I'm afraid. Yeah. <laughs> that was pretty cool. And we're back at the YouTube studio with all the zombies once again. But I'm going to use this katana right here to slash all of them in one single hit. All right, here we go. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> no way. We have just managed to take out pretty much all the zombies in one katana swing, apart from this guy. All right, here we go. Oh, wait, hang on a minute. The YouTube studio. Oh, no. I've destroyed it. 
I was trying to protect it. And now I've destroyed it. Well, you know what? We might as well continue destroying it because why not? This is tear down. It's all about the destruction. Hang on a minute. This YouTube logo right here can't be destroyed. Oh, I can go right through it. Okay, well, that's interesting. Anyway, that is pretty much all the zombies dealt with. That might be the easiest way to kill a bunch of zombie ragdolls. So the katana was very cool and everything. But I think my favorite zombie killing weapon is actually the lightsaber here. So let's give this a go, shall we? Let's see how many we can kill in one big swing. So far, so good. We've taken out quite a lot of them. In fact, I think we've pretty much got all of them. Look at that. Wow. Man, this thing is so overpowered. Ooh, hello, survivor. Dead. There's also a guy here too. Maybe we can just lift him in the air. That's it. Wait for him to come back down. And then wait for it. Wait for it. Lightning. Yes. Okay. Well, that is... That's how we do it. And I've also just realized something. I think the Sif Saber mod has actually been updated because it seems like I can jump higher now and for longer. Look at that. I can like force jump. Wait, I just keep tapping it. I just keep, keep going. Wow. This mod just got even more powerful. Now it's time to nuke the zombies. Here we go. Oh, yes. <laughs> All right. You know what? I take it back what I said about the katana. I think the nuke might be the easiest way. But also, uh, you know, it's pretty laggy too. But anyway, that's uh, that's the zombies taken care of. And unfortunately, the YouTube studio has been completely destroyed as well. But, uh, you know, it had to be done to take out the zombies. Well, actually, it kind of didn't. But, uh, you know, it's fun to see anyway. Hey, look, I can see some of the green screen. I mean, it's in quite a lot of pieces, but it's still there. Ah, so I can once again watch one of my old teardown videos on this piece of green screen. <laughs> Amazing. But anyway, on that note, I'm going to end this one right here. There's another video on the top right. So make sure you go ahead and check that out. Also, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll hopefully see you in that video right there. Goodbye.